top of the morning my loves y'all know i'm gonna be here to talk about it now i know everybody done heard by now that puffy done settled with cassie and that fucking decision came real quick he was like hold on y'all's doing too much out here in these streets y'all i was on instagram yesterday they were literally pulling up a whole bunch of pictures of young miami and cassie and white fingernails and white toenails so y'all this is my question Miami, how much wood chuck chuck could a wood chuck could chuck if he could chuck wood, girl? Because now I'm like, girl, is you taking a success in the pins too, girl? Is you getting a cuckolded, girl? Is you getting a boom cocky? Girl, you getting a little boom cocky all on your face, girl? You getting a little boom cocky, girl? Hey, y'all don't, listen, don't judge me. Don't judge my porn hub history. Don't do that. But girl, is you getting a boom cocky? Fuck it, I like a little nasty bitch. I like a little classy man. It's like, nah, no, I'm serious, though. <laughs> it's funny how the truth speaks for itself. And I'm going to tell you what, Puffy may think that this shit is over because he done settled with um, Cassie. This shit ain't over because the state can still pick up these charges because there's a whole bunch of, like, heinous as domestic abuse allegations going on right here. And I just knew, I knew as soon as Dawn and Aubrey from Danity came, got wind of this once i seen dawn i already knew um aubrey o'day was gonna come out and say something because aubrey o'day has been speaking out about how disgusting fucking puffy is. but once i seen dawn once i seen big dawn and d woods and uh, she calling willie and everybody from day 26 and after i said oh shit they must to shake and back this nigga don't act like y'all remember that good shake and bake from back in the motherfucking 90s, girl, on a good pork chop. Hold on, you know, like Chingy said, give me what you got for a pork chop. Uh, give me what you got for a pork chop. Bitch, give me what you got for a pork chop. That's what these motherfuckers are saying. Give me what you got for a pork chop. Because I'm about to shake and bake that motherfucking shit. Y'all, I promise you. I promise you, this shit ain't over. We just seeing the beginning of it. And I'm going to say that even though that Cassie settled, I'm still praying over this girl's safety because I don't trust this nigga Puffy. But he know he can't do too much right now because all of the eyes is on him. But I promise you, I know a fucking Scorpio. Once they feel betrayed or harmed or victimized by you, this nigga will lay and wait for fucking years before he will enact motherfucking revenge on yourself. I mean, on, on you. So... I'm not going to lie, like, I am kind of nervous for Cassie and her husband because I feel like what, if he does anything, he going to take the husband down first. Because as long as Cassie got that husband right there, she feels safe and she she feel protected. But if he start fucking with that motherfucker husband and that husband start to get fucking scared, bitch, it's game fucking over. It's I'm trying to tell y'all I know Scorpios. I know how the fuck they fucking move they gonna break you from the inside bitch i promise you they gonna take all that confidence and that defense and all of that shit that you got all that bravado they, that motherfucker gonna get in your head and break your ass the fuck down so i promise you this shit not over on puffy side this shit is not over on the justice side y'all just i feel justice wise y'all better rally up together and y'all better fucking team up and take this nigga down where he can't move he don't as long as puffy got money y'all motherfuckers is in trouble and that's all I, i'm gonna keep it 100 with you i mean y'all let me know down in the comments if y'all feel like i'm saying something wrong but i promise you this nigga is steaming right now he's steaming so we're gonna see how this plays out but i just want to say shout out to cassie and for everybody that's like talking shit about cassie about um her taking a settlement isn't that what she wanted? She said she wanted $30 million or she wanted to be paid for her pain. So if he settled and he gave her the $30 million, I'm pretty sure the girl got more than that. I'm pretty sure she shook his ass. I'm pretty sure. And if Puffy is damn near a fucking billionaire, he can spare fucking $30 million after all of that fucking shit that this man has put her through. But the shit ain't over, y'all. It ain't over. And um, like I said, I'm praying for everybody fucking safety. Miami, I'm trying to see how much wood chuck chuck and wood chuck could chuck. A girl, you need to set up your little... Look, look, Miami, if you gonna be doing all that stuff, I, I know Puffy paying you good. But girl, use your talents wisely, girl. If you be doing a little boom cocky, a little don't stop it, bitch. Put that shit out on the way. We already know what the motherfucking... What the white nails do. We know what the white toes do, girl. The fuck? Market yourself, girl. The fuck? Don't let these niggas pamp you. You better get them. Look, 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 look. Manage yourself.
your assets. Y'all don't listen to me. I'm gone.